Blanca. Today we are going to be making gooey chocolate chip cookies. The ingredients we will need to make these chocolate chip cookies are flour, powdered sugar, salt, baking soda, unsalted butter, mini chocolate chip morsels, vanilla extract, two eggs, brown sugar. Our baking tools we will need is a cookie sheet, two mixing bowls, a sifter, measuring cups, measuring spoons, a spoon, knife, scraper, spatula, mixer, parchment paper, cookie dough scoop, and a cooling rack. First, we need to preheat our oven to 330 degrees. First, we will need one of our mixing bowls and our sifter. We are going to be sifting two and a half cups of flour but there is a technique to sifting flour. Most of the time when people need flour, they just measure straight from the back. I will use one fourth of a cup to show. When they scoop straight from the bag and level it off, versus the proper technique of spooning loose flour into our measuring cup. And leveling it off. You can have a significant amount of difference. That difference multiplied by two and a half cups will allow you to over flour your cookies. So we are again going to use the proper technique of spooning in two and a half cups of flour into our sifter. Our second ingredient to go in our sifter is our baking soda. We will need one teaspoon. We're gonna set this aside and discuss butter. In this video, we are using unsalted European butter. But if you don't have any unsalted butter on hand, you will not need to put salt in this recipe. European butters such as these work best because they have a higher percentage of fat. Fat is what's going to make our chocolate chip cookies gooey and yummy. For this purpose, if you are, only have the salted butter, you will not add salt to this recipe. If you use the salted butter and add salt to this recipe, you will over salt your cookies. Because we are using unsalted butter for our recipe today, we will be adding salt to our sifter. We will need one and a half teaspoons. the ingredients together and set them aside.
In our second bowl, we are going to be combining one cup of brown sugar. The brown sugar you are going to be impacting into your measuring cup. and leveling off. In the same bowl, we are going to be combining three fourths of powder sugar. And level it off. Next, we will add our unsalted butter. We will need 10 tablespoons. Our butter should be at room temperature to make it easier to cream together. Now it's time to mix with our blend mixer until creamy. we will add partial of our flour mixture. The reason why we do partial is that we don't want to over flour and cake our soft mixture. We are now going to scrape our sides. And mix one last time. We are now done with our mixer and we'll be utilizing a scraper from here on out. Now we are ready to add our morsels. I prefer mini morsels because it has a better ratio of dough to chocolate chips, but regular sized morsels will do. I put partial of the bag to make it easier to mix. We will mix this with our scraper. If you refrigerate your cookie dough for about 20 minutes to one hour, it makes it a little bit easier to handle, though it is not necessary. Now that our chips are mixed in with our dough, we are ready to put it on our cookie sheet. We will use a standard cookie sheet and put parchment paper on top.
This is a one and a half tablespoon cookie scooper. If you do not have a cookie scooper, that is fine. You can use a one tablespoon measuring spoon to have uniformity with your chocolate chip cookies. With our one and a half tablespoon scoop, we will bake our cookies for 12 to 14 minutes. If you are using a one tablespoon measuring spoon, you will bake your cookies from 10 minutes to 12 minutes. Now our cookies are ready to go in the oven. Now that our cookies are ready to take out of the oven, make sure you take off your cookies from the cookie sheet. If you leave your cookies here sitting, instead of on a cooling rack, they will continue to cook as the pan is still hot. Depending on your cookie size, this recipe will yield two and a half to three dozen cookies. For more fun videos like this, please visit our social media pages and our website at cityoflosalamitos.org slash recreation.